Yo, what's good on my fellow Avengers Squad members? <laughs> Ready for a good saying that? But as you guys see on today's video, we'll be talking about why I feel like Marvel's Avengers is the underdog game of 2020. Now, if you guys know, Marvel's Avengers has been delayed to September the 4th. You know, stuff we know already. You know, I stated my opinion about that already, so you guys should know how I feel about it. But honestly, as I've been looking up on, you know, Twitter and especially websites lately, I've just been seeing people just trash the game a lot for some odd reason. People have just been trashing the game. Now, I'm not saying that it's been full of trash. You know, people just fully trashing the game. You know, it's been some good feedback towards the game and some critical feedback. But honestly, it just feel like people are just trashing the game wait, just for for no reason. And honestly, there's some other games that has been delayed as well. And their reactions is totally different. Now, we got Doom Eternal. At Doom Eternal, it was delayed as well. Nobody was talking about it. Nobody, like, of course people go, you know, announce it that it's been delayed and all, but nobody was saying nothing. Like, I didn't even know the game was delayed until I looked it up to this day. Especially with Last of Us, you know, we got Last of Us 2 next. People was not upset with it. They were, you know, they were happy, you know, they was kind of upset that it was delayed, but they weren't really upset like how this from all the events is just trashing it. You know, people weren't trashing it. But, as I said before, you know, we got Final Fantasy Remake. Nobody was upset about that. Nobody was upset about the delay. Absolutely nobody. When I've been seeing on my timeline, nobody was upset. People were actually happy it was delayed. It was they won a fully polished Final Fantasy game, and it looks really crispy to me. Honestly, in my opinion, you know what I've seen so far for the uh, game, it looks crispy. And with them delaying, it, it might even look more crispy. So that's good with them. But you know, people were okay with that delay as well. And you man, Iron Man VR, you know. I didn't even know Iron Man was VR uh, was delayed until I saw it on Twitter. You know, my boy Evan, he had told me it was delayed. I didn't even know it was delayed until I checked it out. Nobody was really talking about that either. Also, with Cyberpunk. Cyberpunk, even though it's been, you know, it's been a while since that game been in production. You know, it's been rumored and stuff. But now, like, it's officially, you know, in production. We've seen uh, gameplay of it. You know, it's been delayed. Some people were upset. I can't even lie on you. Some people were upset about this. But then again, you know, they've been waiting on the game so long. You can see why they're upset. But, Lord, they, they just don't trash it as much as they're doing Avengers for some odd reason. Now, I'm going to speak on Cyberpunk later on in the video. It got something to do with Marvel's Avengers. Stay tuned for that. But, you know, we got Watch Dogs. Uh, Watch Dogs. I didn't even know Watch Dogs was delayed as well. The Watch Dogs was supposed to come out in January of 2020, and it got delayed. I didn't even know that, honestly. It's, but some people didn't even, if people follow up on the game, they'll probably know about it. But honestly, I didn't even know about it to this day since I'm re, um, recording right now that I didn't know it was delayed. It was crazy. But as you guys see, as I was speaking about these delay reactions, it's so weird how it's, people could be okay with it. Some people are just quiet about it. Some people don't even know some games got delayed at all. But when it comes to most Avengers, oh, it's trash. Oh, it all got the MCU suits. Oh, it's look, it look, the gameplay looks sluggish. I'm like, oh my god, bro. Like, where was the same energy for all these other games when it got delayed, bro? Like, it's you can't just do that. That's just being, that's just being, you know, you're just targeting, just targeting a game for no odd reason. I don't know, man. It's it just really weird to me. And that's another subject I'm going to talk on right now. That I feel like it's the trend just to hate on Marvel's Avengers, honestly. Because, you know, if you guys go on Twitter, you know, just look it up on Twitter. Just type in Marvel's Avengers on Twitter. Just scroll down the, the latest timeline. Just scroll. People trashing the game saying, oh, why the MCU suit's not on there? The game pretty looks sluggish. Oh, this is what's supposed to come out in 20, you know, 2020. You know, this is not my most anticipated game. Like, people, <laughs> it's, 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 it's just really wild to me. And honestly, today, as I'm recording this today, even though this, you know, it's a little thing, you know, IGN posted on their Twitter today that uh, what are their most anticipated games of 2020, and they put Halo Infinite on there, Doom Eternal, Cyberpunk, and Last of Us 2. They are missing so many games on that list. But then again, you have to keep it, you know, you have to be real with them. You can only do four um, pulls on Twitter. But then again, they could have made another post uh, doing the same thing, listing all the other games, but they didn't. And if you guys know, Eric Monciella, if I pronounce his name wrong, I'm so sorry. 
but he's the uh, director of production at Marvel Games, and he tweeted as well on there saying that you're missing a few games on there, and I agree. You're missing a lot of games on there, sir. You can't just put four games on there and expect people to be okay with that. If you guys go in the comments of that uh, post, people are wondering where are some of the other games are supposed to be coming out on there. So, I don't know. I just feel like Avengers really got the heat right now for some odd reason. I'm Honestly, I'm happy in this position that is the underdog. Because when this game comes out and it's flames... I don't want to hear nobody. I don't want to hear nothing. I don't want to hear nobody saying, oh, I've been following up with this game for the longest, man. If I see you trashing on Twitter, I'm flaming you. I'm flaming. I'm promise you, you're getting flamed. Honestly, I'm, I'm letting you know now. You're getting flamed. And I'm... Uh, I'm, I'm going to show you some remorse, but I'm flaming you that, you you know, you've been trashing Marvel's Avengers for this long. And when it turns out to be good, <laughs> best believe you're getting flamed, sir. I promise you that. But now we have to talk about the Cyberpunk and the Marvel's Avengers situation. Because this was on Twitter as well. You know, people trashing it. Uh, if you guys know, uh, Marvel's Avengers and Cyberpunk are coming out in the same month. You know, they're like a week or two apart, if I'm correct. I don't know on the top of my head, honestly. But, um, you know, Cyberpunk is, you know, it's, it's anticipated. You know, I got some hype towards it. But if I have to be brutally honest with you guys, brood, I'm being brutally honest. I'm If I'm saying brutally wrong, <laughs> I'm sorry. But that game does not look, I'm not trying to be a hater or nothing. Like, I really, I'm not trying to be a hater or nothing, but that game does not look interesting to me, bro. <laughs> like, it really doesn't, like, I saw people, when I remember watching it when it was revealed, I'm like, people are really, honestly, I feel like if it didn't have Keanu Reeves in there, people wouldn't be most hyped as they are towards the game, honestly. Because when Keanu Reeves came in there, when he presented the game as well, you know, Keanu, he had the sauce. You know, he had, the, he, had the, um, he had the fame back then. Well, he still got fame now, but, you know, he was at his, you know, I guess you could say a peak or, you know, he was at that high pedestal towards that time when um, Cyberpunk was revealed. And people were very hyped about the game. And I was like, okay, then, you know, that's Keanu Reeves, you know. You know, they made memes about it. You know, you're, you know, I think he said you're you're good or something. I forgot. I, I, I'm rambling at that point. But I don't know. I just feel like I'm not trying to, you know, as I said, I'm not trying to hate on nobody or nothing, but I don't know. Cyberpunk does not look, you know, that interesting or fun to me. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm not, I don't know. I'm, you know, people might say, oh, you just saying that because you, you know, you upload Avengers. So you go say Avengers is go, you know, be cool and all. But I'm like, I'm being honest with you. I'm speaking to you, man to man, woman to woman, child to child, whatever, you know, whatever your age, you know, whatever. It just don't look interesting to me, honestly. I'm, I'm being 100 with you. I don't know. I'm just being 100. But, um, yeah, uh, that's that's today's video. I got all that out my off my uh, system. I had to I had to let some uh, stress out on that one because it's ridiculous, bro. It's ridiculous. It's r it's really ridiculous right now. It's it's terrible in the streets right now. But <laughs> uh, let me, let me let me know what you guys think about Marvel's Avengers being the underdog game of 2020 for right now. Uh, do you are you glad that it's the underdog? So when some stuff come out. Uh, and it's really flames, people, you know, you gonna be like, oh, yeah, I've been repping this game from the beginning. Are you gonna, you know, be like that? Or, you know, are you on the side that, you know, you feel like it's not the underdog? You know, just let me know your opinions below, honestly, because I would like to know. Uh, uh, if you guys enjoyed the video and you go out, you guys enjoy my Avengers content and my content overall, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell as well so you know whenever I upload a video, go live. And, um, yeah. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, as I said below, uh, as I said before, let me know what you guys think below about you know Marvel's Avengers being an underdog game. Do you guys feel like it is or you feel like it isn't? You know, let me know in the comments below. But um, yeah, hope you guys have a good day. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and have a good day. Yeah.